Hi there, I want to talk about a comic book from Jeff Lemire called Royal City. Royal City is a comic book series from Jeff Lemire. We're going to talk about volume one of this series. Um, it's written and drawn by Jeff Lemire. Um, and it follows the story of a town called Royal City and a family within that town. Um, you meet all the four family members, a dad who's in hospital with a stroke, his wife, um, and then their daughter, and their three sons. Um, the one son is a person who's left the town, married to an actress, he's a writer, and he's coming back to the town to obviously see his dad. The daughter is trying to get a development going in the town to try and revitalise it that's rubbing up the wrong way with um, some locals, including her husband, because it will involve getting rid of a factory that a lot of them work at. And the other son is a sort of reprobate. He's constantly on drinking drugs and he's stealing from his own family um, to support that need. They all have a friend called Tommy, um, who looks different to all of them, and it transpires it's a sort of ghost of one further son who died when he was a young age. Uh, it's implied that he drowned. Um, you never actually see the drowning or the incident, you just have to guess that through the story, which is very well done. Um, and they all have Tommy be whatever they need him to be to them. He's not an actual ghost. Um, but he's just sort of, they're sort of haunted by this moment in 1993, which I'm guessing is when he died. And it, it's, it's, you know, stunted their lives or scarred their lives forever. Uh, it's difficult really to explain anything more beyond that because the way it's, Jeff Lemire is good when he writes these sort of people stories. If you've ever read Essex County by him, that's another people story and it just covers people, people's lives and there's amazing efficiency of words that he's got. He has very evocative images in his um, stories, initially you might think his drawing style is a little bit jarring or sort of sketchy but once you get used to it you get drawn in and then the, the things he says seem to sum up certain feelings or ways of thinking very very easily and in a very very digestible way. Uh, by the end of this volume I'm going to read the next two um, because it was a compelling story um, and you just get drawn into it. It just feels like you want to know what happens to these characters and you want to know more and I just felt it was a quality read. I'd recommend it to anyone who wants a sort of grown-up graphic novel to read um, or doesn't want to read something where it's all action um, and it is more just a inviting story. Um, please let me know what you think about Royal City. Do you like it? Um, do you like Jeff Lemire's work when he does this? I think he's best doing this work um, as opposed to superhero stuff. Um, I do like it when he wrote for Valiant though. Um, it's just this I think is where his real sort of skill lies. A bit like Scott Snyder when he does horror stuff. Um, you know, he's fine doing Batman, liked his run, but much better doing certain things. This is Jeff Lemire's sort of gold standard of work. Um, please feel free to like and subscribe, and thanks for watching.